Hey everybody, how's it going? My name is Mark and today I'm going to be sharing with you how I landed my first job in video production. So shortly after I was about to graduate from college in 2018, I started looking around and seeing what job opportunities were available. Now you'd think that I'd go through some traditional routes like maybe LinkedIn or Glassdoor, but <laughs> that ended up not being what I did. Uh, I had a lot of success using Craigslist in the past to find freelance gigs of all sorts of natures, nothing nefarious, I promise. So I decided to turn to Craigslist once again. Uh, on Craigslist, I was looking for any full-time openings in major cities, so Atlanta, New York, places like that, and also around home, but there wasn't a ton around the, uh, the Midwest area where I grew up. So I found this job listing for where I am now on Craigslist, and it seemed kind of bizarre to me looking in retrospect because I don't think we regularly post jobs to Craigslist in the place where I'm working. But this one time, it just happened to work out. So I found a full-time listing there on Craigslist for a video editor, and that's exactly what I was looking for. In school, I was always most comfortable in the editing bay. It's what I had the most experience in. I enjoy cinematography, I enjoy videography, but at the time, what I was most comfortable with is just hiding out in the editing bay. Uh, I'm a computer nerd, I can't help it. <laughs> So I, uh, I applied and it took a couple weeks. I started, you know, not feeling it so much. I thought that maybe I wasn't gonna hear back and I finally heard back. I got a phone call saying that they wanted to bring me in for an interview and I was super, super excited. Of course, it was my first job. Now, this was a entry level position. So unfortunately I was traveling on my own dime, but my fiance, Megan and I, we drove down to Atlanta. We made the 10 hour drive. We crashed at a friend's place uh, who had moved down here before us. And on the day of the interview, I walk into this beautiful new building and a representative from Human Resources meets me in the lobby. She asks, are you ready? And I'm dressed to the nines in my suit, my brand new suit and tie. And I'm like, yes, yes, I'm ready for this. Let's do it. She says, okay. And she leads me back through this long hallway to a conference room. Now, this is a beautiful conference room with nice glass windows all along the back wall a big fancy table with a bunch of seats around it, but something's wrong. <laughs> None of the seats are occupied. There's nobody there. So I'm looking around sort of confused. And then that's when I spot the laptop set up on the table on a little laptop stand. They had me do a Skype interview with one of our team members out in California. I drove 10 hours with my fiance for a Skype interview, <laughs> but it worked out. Um, I, I did really well with the interview. They asked me some general t knowledge technical questions. They wanted to know what I had researched about the company and I was ready for it. I, I always go into these things with a lot of preparation and research and uh, it went well. So I got the position and while I was still down here in Georgia, I had the opportunity to look around and find a place to stay, which I was moving out of state. So that was the whole process in and of itself. So I guess it sort of worked out with it being in the Skype interview anyway, because I needed to be able to see the area, look around and figure out where I want to live. So I've been living at the same place for three years now. I've been working at the same place for three years now. It all worked out, but I still find it to be a funny story driving that 10 hours out for a Skype interview. And that's all I got for you guys. That's how I landed my first video job. I hope you guys all, in, well, maybe not learn something today, but I hope you enjoyed my story and I will catch you all in the next one. Bye.